Kia ora, no mai, hai de mai. We are the Gut Cancer Foundation, the voice of digestive cancers in Aotearoa, New Zealand. We provide information and resources to help you and your whānau navigate cancer. Did you know that your digestive system includes the esophagus, stomach, liver, gallbladder and bile ducts, pancreas, bowel and anus. Each plays a vital role in digesting food and fluids, processing nutrients, absorbing energy, regulating blood sugar and filtering waste. Cancer can occur in any of these organs when abnormal cells grow out of control. Let's take a closer look at the pancreas. The pancreas is a large gland that sits behind the stomach and the back of the abdomen. It is part of the digestive system. The pancreas produces enzymes and hormones that help digest and absorb the food we eat. The pancreas is shaped a bit like a tadpole. It is often described as having a head, body and tail. Pancreatic cancer occurs when abnormal cells in the pancreas grow out of control. Pancreatic cancer can occur in the head, body or tail of the pancreas, but is most common in the head of the pancreas. There are two main types of pancreatic cancer, exocrine and endocrine tumours. This video talks about exocrine tumours or adenocarcinomas. The symptoms of pancreatic cancer can be vague, mistaken for other things. If you notice anything unusual and it's been going on for a while, it's a good idea to go get checked out at your GP. A checkup can be good for your peace of mind. The symptoms to look out for are mid back pain, abdominal pain, tiredness, unexplained weight loss, loss of appetite, indigestion, changes in stools or dark urine, early onset of diabetes, and jaundice, yellowing of skin or eyes. While the cause of most pancreatic cancer is often unknown, there are some factors which may increase your risk, which include a history of diabetes, chronic pancreatitis, a family history of pancreatic cancer, and some inherited syndromes. Lifestyle factors such as excessive alcohol use, smoking, and being overweight can increase your risk. If you have concerns about any symptoms or risks, a GP will be happy to see you. If you or one of your whānau have received a diagnosis of pancreatic cancer, you can find heaps of information, including treatment options and access to support on our website. For more information, visit gutcancer.org.nz.